I'm John Volker, Senior Editor from High Gear Media. One of the things we get asked here at Green Car Reports is how do I get the very, very best mileage? You know, I had 30, I want 40 miles a gallon right now. We're sitting in a 2011 Chevy Cruze Eco with a six-speed manual, which is rated at 28 miles a gallon city, 42 miles a gallon highway. That's a lot of miles. The average combined rating is in the mid-30s. And when we get asked that question, we tend to say, look, anything over 30 is good. If you get a compact car you like, or maybe a hybrid midsize sedan, where the combined rating is in the 30s somewhere, you're doing fine. Don't obsess over those last couple of miles a gallon. Now, all the manufacturers are shooting for 40. People keep saying 40 is the new 30. All Hyundai Elantras get 40 miles a gallon on the highway. This Cruze Eco gets 42 if you get the six speed. Ford has two different models, the Fiesta and the Focus, that have special packages that get you to 40 miles a gallon on the highway. But you know what? We look at it this way. The difference between 33 miles a gallon and 40 miles a gallon is half a gallon of gasoline over 100 miles, okay? That's, what, under two bucks at current gas prices. That's a side order of fries, basically. Don't obsess over those little differences. You know, if you really, really, really want to save gasoline or not use gasoline, look at a plug-in car. There's not gonna be a payback, at least this model year, but that's the way to reduce your gasoline use. But frankly, in the real world, practically, because most people want to pay as little as they can for a car, this is slightly under $20,000 delivered. If you want to save the most fuel, get something over 30 miles a gallon and don't torture yourself over that. You'll be fine.